What's up, YouTube? Coach Guns bringing you week 14, game number 12. This is our last game of the regular <laughs> season. Our loss last week really hurt us. Oh, wrong one. Our loss last week versus Liberty dropped us to third place in Conference USA. And unless um, chaos breaks out, we will not be making the conference championship game after being in first and second place a majority of the season. Just the last, between La Tech, La Tech is a game we should have won, and even if we were lost to Liberty, we should have remained that, we should have kept that second place spot and just weren't able to get it done. Our team has gotten tired, it's gotten lackadaisical, and just a win it's a game we should have won that La Tech game even if we would have dropped even if we would have dropped it's just it's crazy just insane but we got a 4-7 and seven New Mexico State, senior day, senior night, and time to close off the regular season and see where the pieces fall um, coming in the next week, you know? I mean, that's all we could do, ultimately. It's really all we could do. Um, just very disheartening how that whole situation played out but you know it just is what it is and you know I've gotten a lot of questions about like is this going to be my last season at Kennesaw State um, you know it all just depends on you know I've been getting a lot of a lot of m rumors that you know I'd be in that people would be interested in bringing me up at a That'll bring me up for promotion or a new offensive coordinator spot, but I'm really looking for a head coaching position. So unless it's a head coaching position, I'm most likely going to stay. I'm happy here, you know, um, and especially what our future could have on offense. Like, that's something to be super excited for, you know. I won't, I don't want, like, I got a freshman quarterback. I got all these pieces coming in. It's very, very exciting. coordinators nightmares because of his ability they're gonna have a hard time slowing him down no they just doesn't have those uh, there's Westmoreland going down I'll tell you what we really need to do though is finish off this season strong no matter what happens in the conference whether we go to the conference championship game we got to control what we can control you know and uh, New Mexico State they're not as talented as us they're not as good of a team as us and it's important in my opinion that we finish out strong how big would it be for us to finish the regular season with an 8 and 4 record a chance out of a good bowl game picking up the first down New Mexico State to the line after picking up the first down to the ground he's got it again it's just a very important that we just keep it up you know we've kind of tailed off the past four games offensively we've kind of been in a small rut but i mean Injuries of stacking up, our team's banged up, and you know, we're still trying to build that depth. That was a really good sack there. And, uh, you know, this is what it is at that point. At the end of the day, though, like I said, it's important that we finish strong and we keep up the momentum. Because if you think about it, and which is another reason why I don't want to leave unless it's for a head coaching position, if you think about it, like, we have a lot of returning talent next season. Our quarterback's the second year in the system. We need to grab some wide receiver talent, yes. But, I mean, we need to get there, man. Come on, get there. He's going to... Holy shit. Good. 
you know, we have a lot of talent coming back. And, you know, if we don't make a run this year, there's a good possibility that, you know, if we have a good off season, we pick up some pieces on the outside that we can make a run next year at least. So, like I said, I'm not, like, too eager to leave, not even for, like, a upgraded coordinator spot, you know. Like, my whole goal is to be a head coach, you know. And I don't mind going to a small up-and-coming program. Like, I wouldn't be mind being the head coach at Kennesaw. Got to make that catch, man. That's, that's something we got to get better at is on the outside. Definitely got to look into the transfer portal because um, based on how our offense was last season, there weren't a lot of receivers looking at us, you know. And that's definitely going to be a spot we're going to have to look at, into the portal about upgrading our talent. And especially we got, I think, Bohannon's a senior. He's going to be leaving. So we're going to need some help on the outside. If we want to take that next step, there's Moss with a great catch over the middle. If we want to take that next step, in progression, not only as an offense but as a team, you know, we're, we're going to have to get better on the outside. Our offensive line, we're we're bringing in a lot of talent. That 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 position should remain very competitive going deep. What was that, bro? That position should remain very competitive and talented. As long as we keep bringing in talent, you know, there's always going to be competitive depth there. Guys battling it out for a starting spot, so that's always going to be good. Just like I said, got to make sure that we finish strong here. We should be making it to a bowl. Probably pick up another running back in the portal this offseason if possible. Because Bernard's going to be leaving. Just for depth. Obviously, if you could pick up talent, you're going to pick up talent. We're good, like I said, in the tight end room, the offensive line. We got more talent coming in. They're going to keep battling it out in the offseason. <laughs> Problem is, we got to find a way to upgrade. The skilled position, the outside skilled position, somehow in the portal. Hopefully, some guys are interested in this. I mean, wish they should be. I mean, we've showed the propensity this season to throw the ball way more than we did last season. So, there's that. Defense. Stop. New Mexico State, that's the team I played a lot with in NCAA 14. I like their uniforms. Always have a sweet spot for New Mexico State. New Mexico State and Idaho. Because they're just two places that, in my opinion, are just really hard to win at. Or maybe it wasn't New Mexico State. Maybe it was New Mexico. I think that those two places are just really hard to win at. I'd really love to use Idaho, but I don't like how the team builder schools have generic entrances. Or they don't show entrances at all. And the stadium's all messed up. Ooh, a nice RPO there. And then on defense, you know, Coach is doing a great job with the defense in this new 4-2-5 scheme that they, that you know, since we switched over from the 3-3-5. But um, ultimately, what it comes to the defense, it's just one of those things. You just got to keep bringing in talent, keep building from the trenches. I'm, I'm one of those coaches that, you know, builds from the trenches out kind of deal. Because ultimately, if, oh, that should have been a TFL right there, man. 
ultimately if your trenches aren't in a good spot then your secondary is not going to be in a good spot your linebackers aren't going to be a good spot it all starts with the trenches even on offense you know you could have the best running back receiver tandem in the country but if you don't have an offensive line to protect your quarterback to get the run game going then you're not going to be as successful got to start with the trenches on both sides of the ball and you know as the oh that should have been pick as a director of scouting and recruiting that's what I've been trying to do for these guys is building on the trenches oh that was a nice catch after a big hit over the middle We're not getting a lot of pass rush today. That's what's stopping us right now. They've dominated the time of possession too. If we could get a red zone stop here, that'd be huge. Oh. Didn't fill correctly in the nickel spot. I'm just ready to take over my own program, you know. As much as I love being here at Kennesaw, being with Bernard, Thule, and all these guys, you know, I'm just ready to start my own program, you know. And it doesn't have to be a power five spot. Like I said, I'm cool taking over something small. And uh, I feel like, you know, I feel like, you know, I have a lot to offer an uh, up-and-coming program, you know. I've shown that I could lead the direct, be a director of scouting and recruiting. I could build a team. I mean, obviously, all the credit goes to the head coach, but I've clearly been instrumental in recruiting. And then getting the offense on track in our second year has improved drastically. I'm sure when we look at the end of the year stats, it's going to look a lot better. That's just how I feel regarding all that. Just see what happens. I'd love to go to the conference championship game. I think that'd be a cool experience, but. Man, we are just not blocking right now. On both sides of the line of scrimmage. We're getting out physical right now. Nice scramble there by Tuli. I wish we wouldn't take as many sacks as we have this season. That's like my biggest thing, but I feel like it's just a game design thing. I'm happy with our play calling this year. I'm happy with our play design. Could it be more complex? Yeah. Is there things we still need to improve on? Yeah, but year two in our system compared to how we were last year as a, an anemic passing game. I'm happy where we are. I'm happy with the progress. And a freshman quarterback who I think has played outstanding. Truly, he's broken a lot of uh, season records too as a freshman. That's what I'm talking about. That's how you run the ball. Any offense that picking up six, seven yards a carry is going to be unstoppable, especially with a competent passing game. Bro, you should have caught that. That should have been six right there, my boy. Ugh. 
see if Tuli can make a play. Just turn, don't turn the ball over. Trying to have to take a sack. Almost got there. So it's very unfortunate we're gonna have to settle for three here. I think in our second season here, we've definitely given the University of Kennesaw, Kennesaw State University, something to be excited about. We've definitely progressed a lot faster than all the national media and even folks here have thought we'd progress. Getting us with that short passing game right now. Which, based on the defense we run, should be, we should be pretty good at stopping this. That was a good play by Johnson there. And then, like, players like Johnson who are going to be in another year of development, Westmoreland. Nice play right there. Alright, let's see if we can get a pass rush here on third down. We got two of our better pass rushers out there right now. Nice. Oh my god, get there. Come on. We're not tackling good today. Telling you, very proud of Thule how he runs this offense. Oh, dang it! He didn't get it off. That's the one thing I don't like. What he does is how he waits. Like, you, if you're gonna take a deep shot, you gotta take a deep shot early. You can't wait for. He takes his deep shots too late. Now we're behind the sticks. Hopefully we can make a play here. Yeah. Mm. Backside pressure got us on the play action veer. Yes, trying to slow him down as much as possible, but it's predicated too on me reading that and me seeing it. And they didn't bite it at all. You better run the football effectively if you're going to run play action because they did not bite on the play action fake at all. They've already racked up big sack numbers. It's starting to snowball, and they are ready to go again. Using the back as a receiver on the screen. Listen, running backs are not just running backs anymore. You're going to be a wide receiver today. That running back screen's been really good for us. 
Come on, get there. Get the first down. Motion, trying to get the defense to show his hand. Just let it go to the two minute warning. Just reset it. You don't want to give them too much time anyway. Bro, come on. What are you doing? Come on, Thule. Go for it. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Fourth and inches, we got a good offensive line. Get it. Bro. He ran right into the. Oh my god, bro. You gotta have better vision than that, dude. Frustrating. That was there. The ship. That play was there too. Maybe we could get a turn over here. God, get there, bro. Oh, my God. He, oh, I thought he caught it in the end zone. Just crazy. We should have more points than that. We shouldn't be taking as many sacks as we are. We should have more points than that. We should have caught a touchdown pass there. Just 
got to tighten it up, man. We're playing sloppy. These past four or five games, we've been playing sloppy, sloppy football, man. Catch my right. It should be seventeen seven minimally right now. Lost the throw on first down off the play fake. Now he's gonna break the pocket. He's gonna run it. He turns this into a nice game and gets down to avoid the hit. Kennesaw State coming out with another first down. Take your force up, right? He gets outside the pocket. Man, I what do I do? <laughs> that was run by our tight end. Oh, nice play down the seam right there. That was a high level throw right there. Block that edge, man. Keep it up. Nice powerful run right there. He has an extensive juke library what the and hell? he exhausted it and still didn't pick up much. Not a lot of ground to cover and not much to defend. Third down right here. Down in the red zone. From the gun, wants to pass. Dances away. That's six. Good job, Tooley. <laughs> With the gritty. Get there, get there. Nice pass defense. 
this game's still tight. They keep their feet to the fire, so an opportunity here to keep Let's go get a stop. For a man. It's oh, no way. I don't like that call. The offense gets a fresh center down after the PI. We'll see if the defense can regroup and put together a stop. They'll give it to the back. It's a nice stop tackle by the corner the or safety there. The Solid pick up four, you got this stack formation. I don't like how we're li lining up in the stack at the bottom of the screen. Got his man quickly. And a good job of coverage by that defense. Just a short I like how we lined up at the top of the screen. I didn't like the bottom of the screen. There we go, get there. There we go. And the pressure gets to him now and goes to quarterback. Now that's a pass rush. Playing man coverage in the back end. Need to win up front. Those guys got to get to the quarterback. Do a great job rushing the passer. I can play man when I got a pass rush like that. New Mexico State will be forced to punt. Let's see if he can help the coverage team out with this one. I feel like if we rushed that, we might have been able to block that. Nice return. We got good field position. We need to go put it in the end zone again right here. Oh, nice throw on the comeback there. It sets up the RPO game, and then you keep this defense guess. You could stay up late. Going deep. Just throws that deep ball too late. Just throws that deep ball just too late, man. Nice run. He works his way inside the 30 down. Oh my god, Tuli. What are you doing, bro? Getting shooken up like that. Slide. Injury on that last play, and we'll take a break to check him out. This Kennesaw State offense is on the move. Pulls and fires it complete to the right. They make the stop, but there is a flag on the field. We'll see what that's all about. The officials offer the deal, and the coach accepts it. They will take the penalty. Here's the snap, looking to throw. Let's see what they've got on second down. He's looking to throw. Unloads to the wideout. He's got it, and they'll knock him down. Third and short from the 22 is the field goal unit. Let's go, Bohannon. Convert. They'll try to get it through the air. Get there we go. He was working his way toward that goal line. They'll stop him at the two after a big play up top. The execution on that screen pass is one that will go into coaching play. Nice execution on the screen. Allow the rush to come up field. Now I release. Get the ball to the running back. I got my playmaker in space. I don't know why his Bernard's face is glitched like that. Come on, punch it in the end zone. Tooley's back in. There you go. Nice and easy. Nice. If we get another stop and score another seven, <coughs> I think we are in control of this game. They'll try to add another to their lead. And with the extra point, they now have a three possession lead at 17-14. 
17. About to kick it away after scoring the touchdown. On the move from inside is five. Not a lot of space to be found. Good hustle by the coverage team, and they stop him at the 21. The New Mexico State offense returns to the field. Come on. They're on the blitz. Nice open field tackle, though. Is that an illegal man downfield? Oh, roughing the passer. Even worse. So absolutely, this quarterback, he wants to drive this offense down the field and at least put something on the field. Just couldn't stay off the quarterback and that roughing the passer call has them set up with a first and ten. Nice hit by Porter. They stop him almost immediately. Short game there. Still a little ground cover. Pick up the first. He's going to pass on second down. Nice hit. Third down. Oh, nice sack. That dude shot out of there like a cannon to make that play. Freshman, too. Like I said, we got some pieces, even for next year. Just got to find some wide receiver talent. We've dropped a lot of balls. At times, didn't get separation like we need to. And then we're going to have to replace Bohannon. the snap off no oh he did I'd like to get him a touchdown pass in the season top 25 college football playoff got rivalry week Conference championship game and the playoff are set. Moving the running back, trying to get the D to tip its hand. Grab behind the line. It's green. Makes the grab and it's enough for the first down before he's dragged to the ground. This Kennesaw State offense is on the move. From the gun, the running back has it. Nice run. Drop. Come on, one more touchdown. We still the same. That was a nice seam play. He's been hitting those seams really nicely today. Gotta make that catch, baby. Bump and run. Get Moss on the slant. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Good job, Moss.
good play. Bad angle, 39. Keep coaching up heading into their next game. Perfect play call for that big game to open the drive. Now here they come on first and ten. Dropping back, it's Webster. And that incomplete pass caused by the big hit on first down, second down coming. After the misfire now on second down. He's looking to throw. Makes the grab on the left. They make the stop after the catch and still some work to do to pick up that first down. In the dead center of the field as they try to convert this third and short. Throws to the wideout. It's caught down. Gotta make that play. Really nice pick up on that one as they get it to the 36. It'll be first down. He's looking to throw it. Gotta make that play too. There we go. Nice run stuff there by the freshman. Got it. And they make the tackle, but he has plenty for the They're wasting down. a lot of time, though, I'll tell you that. Oh, Westmoreland make the tackle. It was a highlight play, man. You got to make that play. You got in the backfield, you disrupted it, and now make the tackle. Looks like we'll be finishing the regular season eight and four, and uh, we'll find out where our conference bid is at. Oh my God, he was almost gone. 
That would have been cool to finish out the regular season like that. That's it. Good game, guys. Way to finish the regular season strong. All for the seniors. Good job. Couldn't be more proud of these guys. Nailed him to 22 rushing yards. Not bad, man. Not bad. Can't be mad at a performance like that. All right, before we sign off, I guess we'll see where we're at. Do we make the conference championship game? Nice commit. I think, oh, this is Army-Navy week. So one more week until conference. Oh, well, we'll basically know right here. Conference standings. Oh, my God, Georgia Tech upset Georgia. Ah, uh, didn't make it, man. Or maybe, uh, no, I don't think so because we lost to Liberty. They have the tiebreaker over us. And then UTIP has a better win-loss record than we do. Pretty sure we don't. Let's finish up some recruiting. Man, 37th ranked class, man. Not bad. Talk about bringing in talent. Obviously, there's still a long way to go, but, man, not bad. bad man not bad at all Yep. Didn't make it, man. Well, don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. I'll bring the off season. We'll figure out what the plan is on our next episode. Thanks for watching. Coach Guns out.